Hello, baby. Jim is here. <laughs> just a quick one. Just a quick one because I just realized it's 4th of July. Po, po, 4th of July, the Americans now, Tom Cruise, you know, <laughs> Top Gun, they're all very happy. And I was, you know, I was reconsidering a little bit the situation because a few years back, my generation, not now the millennials and the, the new generation, you know, a few years ago, everybody was, uh, you know, wearing T-shirts, USA, I don't know what, USA. 4th of July, it's like it was uh, the world, the world, uh, the world national day, because we were completely contaminated by the Americans. Now everything has changed. You know, a few years ago, Facebook didn't exist, but now nobody puts a happy 4th of July on Facebook and Instagram. No, 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 now everybody's quiet. Everybody's very quiet because it's, it's not trending topic. You know, it's not hashtag to say uh, USA, USA anymore. Now it's finished. Yet because they fucked us for so many years. After they finished with South America in the 60s, they went to the Middle East and now, you know, different areas of the world. And I was thinking, you know, if there was a, a probability of talking to an American, a Republican, you know, to tell him, like, well, okay, 4th of July, what are you, what are you celebrating? No! So I called my friend Dan Gordon, he's from, uh, he's a Republican from, uh, from Idaho. To Lord Malaga, Dan, what are you celebrating 4th of July? Well, it's our national day, you know, it's the day our founding fathers created this marvelous democratic uh, country. Ah, the day you created the, the country, your founding fathers, eh? But tell me, you know that these guys today would be terrorists? Well, not exactly, because they were defending freedom in our country, freedom, like years, because you, it was a secession from the British crown, you know, from Her, Her Majesty's crown. Today you would be terrorist, and you would be sent to Guantanamo, where you sent the guys in orange, not the guys from the uh, uh, the, uh, the the Hindus, you know, the Buddhists. No, 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 the the, the one you put in orange, call Abdullah, Mohammed, all these guys in orange to Guantanamo. Well, actually, we were fighting for our freedom. Your freedom? Ah, so you fought for your freedom, so that I understand, sorry, eh? You fought for the freedom so that then you can take the country from the Native Americans. Well, we were sharing the country. Ah, you were sharing the country, yes, yes. Like the Israelis and the Palestinians, you were sharing the country, but then you keep the country. <laughs> this is fantastic, Ramalaka. And tell me, after you fucked all the, the Native Americans, you put them in reserves, which is like a big zoo. You know, a reserve, it's like a zoo. You want to see a Native American? Go on to the reserve. Ah, to go to the zoo, no? And tell me, well, actually, we were we were a real country when we celebrated and we took uh, the independence of Texas. Texas, Anerima, like I forgot, sorry, Texas. Of course, Texas. Texas, which belonged to Mexico, by the way, and the Treaty of uh, Guadalupe Hidalgo, and you fucked the Mexicans and you took 33% of their country. Yes, yes, yes. Now I remember, this is the independence of Texas. No? <laughs> Malaga, Dan Gordon, you're fantastic. But there is one thing, there is one thing I am very happy <laughs> because, uh, you know, they started a few years ago with this uh, Halloween thing. The Halloween contamination, absolute propaganda. So now they're celebrating Halloween, even in, you know, in the Qatar, the good guys from Qatar, <laughs> they're celebrating Halloween. Even Dubai, Abu Dhabi, uh, Riyadh, Jeddah, Saudi, you know, they're celebrating Halloween. Halloween, which is an Anglo-Saxon, Protestant, uh, a completely pagan, completely pagan festivity, but they celebrate it because it sells. So as long as you make money and there is business, it doesn't matter if you are an infidel, you know, an infidel, like the, <laughs> the Islamic State says, an infidel, you're an infidel. I'm a, like I'm an infidel, but for, uh, for Halloween, I'm not an infidel. No, because you make money. After all, like, this is what you're trying to tell me. So Halloween, okay, Masgamisan, a complete uh, cultural contamination, appropriation, and this is the neocolonialism. This is the neocolonialism. For many years they had Hollywood to contaminate the world. Now Hollywood is fucked up because we have Netflix, so they start with the festivities. The next thing coming, and I hope it's not coming, it's Thanksgiving. You know, uh, we are so stupid in Europe, and uh, not all the world, but in Europe we are very stupid. You will see that in one, two, three years we will start celebrating Thanksgiving as if it was our own festivity. Remalaga, so tell me if you, f <laughs> if you celebrate 4th of July as if it was the world's Independence Day, maybe we should celebrate those as well the world, you know, Independence Day, I don't know, Mozambique, for example, of Trinidad Tobago, I don't know, of Aruba, for example of Madagascar, for example. Well, the only thing worth celebrating is the 4th of July. Ah, bravo, Tom Cruise. <laughs> bravo, Tom Cruise, you're a genius.
So, okay, let's hope we don't celebrate the Thanksgiving and let's hope we try to <laughs> all maintain our diversity, like they say now with the gay pride. Diversity, diversity, ah, cultural diversity. You know, I like having in Europe Europeans because they call us Europeans. Yeah, but from, from Stockholm to Athens, there's a difference. And from uh, Madrid to, I don't know where, uh, Helsinki, there's a difference. So diversity, yes, but you know, it's always good to have diversity and accept cultural diversity. Accept your neighbors like your brothers and learn from different cultures. Not go against different cultures, learn from them. You see the Greek genius, think about it. Yeah, 4th of July, at the Malaga America, celebrate your day. Jimmy Tsapas, the Greek genius, think about it.